So in the previous videos, we learned how to construct a frequency polygon by using a histogram and also solved in the subsequent video an example to illustrate the procedure that we showed to construct a frequency polygon by using histogram. This video, let us look into uh, constructing a frequency polygon without using a histogram. The first step is obtain the frequency distribution. The second step is compute the midpoints of class intervals. The third step is represent the midpoints obtained on x axis on a suitable scale. The fourth step is represent the frequencies on y axis on a suitable scale. The fifth step, plot the points xi, fi, where xi denotes midpoint and fi the corresponding frequency. The sixth step is to join the points plotted in step 5 by line segments. The seventh step is take two class intervals of zero frequency, one at the beginning and other at the end, obtain their midpoints. Now, yeah, these classes are known as the imagined classes. Do you remember we did this in the previous frequency polygon by using the histogram? And the eighth and the final point complete the frequency polygon by joining the midpoints of first and last class intervals to the midpoints of the imagined classes adjacent to them. So, as usual, the forthcoming video will illustrate an example based on the steps of the construction of frequency polygon without using a histogram.